any of these at this point, but you just got a lot of good reps in today. Um, so here's right sides of the very first swing of the day, essentially, that we recorded. Um, again, hips never really slide forward, body's turning a lot, arms get into this chicken wing scoop flip position. Okay, and again, that's going to create some issues with the contact because you're shortening the arc up post-impact, through and post-impact. Okay, so certainly here, we talked about the up-the-wall drill, right? I had you swinging with that alignment rod, and I took a video of that on my phone, so I'll post that uh, underneath in the comments here. Um, but again, we were feeling that right arm starting to cross over the, the left arm. So really left arm supinating or forearm rotating as we exit. Again, glove logo, club face would start to face more to the left. And you can see that the arms did get a little bit straighter there. Okay. Um, ultimately, I think a combination of that up the wall and what we were doing here at the end with this front loader drill. Again, you start post impact, face more closed. Certainly more out to right field with the club head. Sensation is that the pressure is more left and the body's not turning at all, right? And we just start there and then try to cross back through that point in the exit here. Again, we got way better delivery of the club. Look at your arms bending here on the right side versus straightening here on the left side. Mm -hmm. Look how much straighter they are post impact. Much, much better. And again, now the shot pattern is going to change. We're going to start to get more of a draw instead of a fade. Okay? Yes, sir.